It's 516, and now let's head over to Brian to check the weather forecast for today. Is it going to warm up from... What, upper 50s right now? Oh, no, we're going to say 50s all day. We're okay. done. Bye, Steve. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Some sad news. First of all, I had, to, I had to stop exercising. No, you said don't stop exercising. I was right. kind of excited for a second. Then FAO Schwartz closing. That is, uh, if you've ever been to New York City, it is a staple. Uh, my kids love it. Can't break the news to him. I'm not going to tell him. Yesterday, 78 degrees in Milwaukee. Also in Racine, the humidity stayed high through the early afternoon hours. And then all of a sudden, the wind shifted. If you were outdoors, you could just feel that dry air moving in and the cooler temperatures as well. Got a little brisk uh, later in the evening. I was out in Menominee Falls until well, well after sunset, and it got pretty chilly out there. Uh, you can softball game. I, just, I wasn't just roaming around uh, Menominee Falls. My, my kids had a softball game. Menominee Falls. Uh, clear sky this morning. Uh, uh, and it is going to bring us a lot of sunshine throughout the day today. Enjoy it. And it's going to be very comfortable. Dew points have dropped into the 50s, 57 degrees in Milwaukee, about 15 degrees cooler than it was yesterday morning. 50 in Waukesha. That is a 49 in Watertown and Green Lake. It is 52 in Port Washington, uh, waking up to 50 in Menominee Falls. Good morning to you. 51 in Muskego and 50 out towards Maguanago down to the South Burlington and Waterford at 51 degrees. Palmyra and Sullivan at 49 degrees into the north. A lot of upper 40s. Elkhart Lake at 48, Ripon at 49 and West Bend at 52. As I mentioned, about 13 to 20 degrees cooler this morning than it was yesterday morning. And in addition to that, it's not humid at all. 44 up in Rhinelander this morning, 61 in La Crosse. Around Waukesha County, you're seeing upper 40s to lower 50s this morning. Uh, that humidity, that high dew point is way down to the south. That dry Canadian air has pushed in and will be with us throughout the day today and for tomorrow as well. Still comfortable. But then Thursday night, a warm front moves in here and it is going to get hot and it is going to get humid. Sticky air Friday, Saturday, Sunday and into Monday. If you don't like the humidity, it's around for quite a while. July has arrived. Upper 60s to right around 70 degrees at the lakefront today. Lower to mid 70s inland with a light easterly breeze and a whole lot of sunshine. As you can see on the map today by 2 o'clock, not even a cloud out there. That light breeze. Tomorrow, though, things begin to change. By 11 or 10 o'clock, we'll see a few isolated showers. But then as the late morning and early afternoon wears on, we'll see an increasing chance of showers and thunderstorms. And that will persist into the evening hours for tomorrow as well. That is out ahead of that warm front that will bring us the warmer summer air. 70 today, 70 three tomorrow and then the rain showers and thunderstorms are likely Thursday night 87 degrees and humid with a few scattered thunderstorms firing back up Friday afternoon. We'll have these thunderstorms each and every day now over the weekend. Not a washout, but with the heat and the humidity, it'll be a Florida type forecast with those afternoon thunderstorms popping up. Tatiana taking a look at speeds right now.